All right, what's up, you guys? It's Shady Gamer back with another video, back with another banger. Look, you guys, hit the subscribe button, join the Shady team today. If you have not joined the Shady team yet, then what are you doing? Because on this channel, I cover the latest Nickelodeon All Star Brawl 2 news. And also, if you like to go ahead and get your name on the Wall of Fame, join the official Shady team membership today. So, you guys, Nickelodeon All Star Brawl 2 is going to be coming out, I'm sure, in October of this year. So, with that being said, it got many people that plan on pre ordering the game, or some people that could wait until after the game come out to go ahead and get the game, which that's understandable as well. But, you guys, for those of y'all that plan on pre ordering, this video right here is a pre order guide on which edition should you get. Now, I did a poll on Reddit and I asked people, which edition of Nickelodeon All Star Brawl are you getting? Because there's three editions there's the base edition, the deluxe edition, and the ultimate edition. And 82 people said that they were getting the base edition, and the other 82 said again, ultimate edition. And only 17 people said they're getting the deluxe edition. So it seemed like not as many people is really that interested in getting the deluxe edition, but more people are interested in getting the base edition the ultimate edition and i think i understand why because in some games you know usually the first edition will be the most the second edition will be like the second most that people want then the last one will be the least amount but a lot of people want the ultimate edition but i'm gonna go through all three and explain to y'all what do each edition comes with and which one will probably be best suited for you so hopefully the video actually helps you with making your decision on what edition of the game you want unless you already made your mind though so you guys up first we have the base edition so the base edition is only 50 dollars that is actually the cheapest a new game could kind of be right now well at least a game to this caliber because a lot of games that's coming out now is 70 dollars so the base edition of nickelodeon all-star brawl 2 is only 50 dollars which if you go back to like 2012 that would be a 40 dollar game so in today's time a 40 dollar game is a 50 dollar game unfortunately that's inflation but this is actually a good price for a new game especially if you're really interested into nickelodeon all-star brawl now this only comes with just the game that's it and from what i'm told this is the only version that you can get to where it's a physical copy all the other ones are digital so the deluxe and ultimate edition are only digital but if you get this edition if you pre-order this edition you also get the pre-order bonus of patrick cosmetic the elastic waistband cosmetic which i think this is going to be one of the better cosmetics in the game so you get that as well if you pre-order it but you only get the game and if you pre-order it you get the patrick cosmetic as well so this edition right here is kind of good for people that rather want to save money or they probably looking to not probably play the game that long they're going to wait before they get the dlc and all for the game which i'm gonna get to that later on in the video because the game do have dlc and you can wait to buy the dlc or you could get it with the next editions which the speaking of the next editions the deluxe edition the edition that seemed like not that many people are interested in getting now with the deluxe edition it is 69.99 70 dollars whatever it said the deluxe edition is a digital only edition that includes the base edition plus the season pass now i say i'm going to talk about the season pass now this, this is the season pass right here so with the season pass you get four characters plus costumes released throughout 2024 which they didn't even tell us how many costumes it is which i didn't realize that before compared to the first time when i read it but yeah you get costumes released throughout 2024 and a premium spongebob costume available at launch now the base game is 50 dollars and a deluxe edition is 70 dollars right but guess what if you buy just the base edition which is 50 dollars and you buy the dlc pass the season pass that's 75 dollars so actually you save five dollars if you go ahead and just get the deluxe edition you get the dlc costumes released throughout 2024 the four new characters and all that and then if you do pay 70 dollars for it basically you're paying the price for a brand new game because the new games that's coming out these days is 70 dollars so there you go now everybody not really interested in the deluxe edition but people are actually very interested in the premium edition which this is the edition i am getting and i'm gonna tell y'all why and to be honest if you're interested in nickelodeon all-star brawl 2 and if you actually have the money for this i would advise you guys to get this right here and i'll explain why so the ultimate edition or you could call it premium edition but would you say ultimate edition since that's what's on the site so the ultimate edition is 80 dollars it says the ultimate edition is a digital only edition that includes the deluxe edition plus one exclusive bonus costume for each character 
now you guys i'm gonna let y'all know this is the addition to where you get the most bang for your buck and i'm gonna explain why right so not only do you get the base game and not only do you go ahead and save five dollars and you get all the dlc characters plus the one premium spongebob skin and also costumes released throughout 2024 but for basically another ten dollars you get an exclusive costume for every single character that's in the game so now let's say for example right let's say this game only had 20 characters right which this game have more than 20 characters coming to this game it gonna be like 30 something characters when it's all said and done but let's say this game only had 20 characters do you know another 10 dollars break down to like 50 cents a skin so think about the how much it breaks down to when you go ahead and you have like 30 plus characters you pay cents for each of these costumes for every character in the game so that's why a lot of people are actually looking to pre-order this edition and the thing about it though is this to be honest i feel like this this is just my opinion i feel like you should get rather the deluxe edition or the ultimate edition if you're really interested in this game reason why i said you can have at least all the characters in the game you might not be able to have all the cosmetics but you know cosmetics don't affect nothing but you want to be able to play with all the different characters because you know that's a gameplay element of the game so i would say get the deluxe or the ultimate edition but if you want to get the best edition that's fine you might not want to play online nothing like that or whatever or you might not care about the dlc characters that's fine too but it looks like a lot of people is just getting the ultimate edition because they do want the full experience of the game they won't be able to enjoy all the cosmetics and all the characters in the game and stuff like that which to be honest when you really break it down you take the time to really look at it i gotta say this really is a good deal because like i said most games that's coming out these days is seventy dollars like triple a games and all that other stuff and if a new smash bros came out it'll be seventy dollars as well rightfully so but the game is only fifty dollars at base edition but if you get the premium edition of the game the ultimate edition of the game which is eighty dollars basically you're paying the price for a full price game which is seventy dollars and kind of looks like you're just paying like another ten dollars for like cosmetics and stuff like that which you know if you play fortnite and stuff like that you know you spend way more than that or whatever but like i said only people that really really interested in this game gonna really you know get that edition of the game and if you do get the base edition that's fine too you know we could go ahead and play nickelodeon all-star brawl 2 together and all but at the end of the day it really comes down to you how much you want to spend on this game do you want the full experience by getting the uh, ultimate edition do you just care about just getting the dlc and all like that you not worry about cosmetics get a deluxe edition if you just want to kind of test the waters or you might not really care about really playing this game for the long term then the best edition might be better for you and you can always get the dlc later but it will be kind of like another five dollars compared to if you just get the deluxe edition or the premium the ultimate edition of the game but you guys, look, I want y'all to do me a favor. Comment down below and let me know what edition of the game are you getting. I really want to hear y'all opinion. But thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, share the video, and also subscribe and join the Shade Team. Join the Shade Team. Thank you guys for watching. Shout out to the Shade Team as always, and I'm out.